What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Um, so much happened yesterday over to today. Like, it's so much to talk about. I'm just giving y'all whatever I can right now that's going to hit the algorithm, to be honest. Then I'm going to go live tonight, and y'all going to get... We, it's going to be a great live. Um, so right now, we're going to get into Tesseki. Basically, she's saying... Um, She's saying to stop telling her to leave her man because she ain't going away. Ain't nobody going to tell me leave my nigga. Been with him for eight years. Nobody's going to tell me leave my nigga. And we fight all the time. So with that being said, stop trying to tell people what the fuck to do. If you got something to say, keep that shit to yourself. Because most likely what you have to say will get the shit slapped out of you. And that's that. So that's what she got to say. I don't know who trying to get her to leave her man. And another thing, y'all got to know that these women are products of their mother, which means um, they're going to stick beside him. Their mother stuck beside their daddy. Um, and that's just kind of that on that. So I think people need to leave her alone before they get slapped. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's number one. Number two. Girl, let's get into this Mariah Lynn Asian doll situation. I don't know if y'all watched the uh, Baddies Caribbean last night, and I don't know if y'all watch it, but if you do, um, tap into my Patreon because, baby, Asian doll put her ass whooping on Mariah. I'm sorry to say it, but that's what she did. And I don't know why Mariah kept going. It's like she kept running into a brick wall, and I'm not understanding why. First of all, the whole beef was pretty much over uh, Mariah Lynn alleging that Asian Doll said something about chocolate women, which is crazy because she's a chocolate woman. Somebody tried to come in my comments today talking about, um, because I did, you know, the BET Awards. I, you know, did the outfits from 1 to 10 or whatever. And some of them didn't have good outfits, quite frankly. Okay? Akon had on shoes that looked like he was going to mop in something, going to jump in something, hop in some water, something. It just wasn't cute. And a couple of, a couple other people. Bro, that's not colorism. I don't like the outfit. What are we talking about? But a lot of chocolate women and chocolate men came to slay at the BET Awards. Leave me alone. Okay? So anyway, I don't know why she said that about Asian and I, maybe she did say it. I don't know. I ain't here to say it. Okay. But they got into it because of that. Check it out on my Patreon. Link is in the uh, description. Asian now said, now I'm going to whoop that hoe again. Internet AB. Mad I'm reposting what fans are posting. Itch. Talking about somebody. Mango. Talking about somebody body uh, when she has ass shots herself that don't match her, the F, that Photoshop A pick looks nothing like my body, that itch a hater um, that keep trying to put, I don't know, it was, it kept going. Let's not act like the body pick of Asian is not Photoshop, and Asian, your face was sitting pretty all four rounds, uh, which is true, which is absolutely true. She also said, I beat that B up four times and closed her eye, had to be Wearing glasses for two weeks is nothing she can say that will make me mad. Itch. I beat you to F up, H-O-E, and had you crying and had your friends switch on you in your face. The biggest brat. Itch. Okay, y'all know one thing about Asian Doll Child. When she start talking, she's going to keep talking. I, I'm i going to put this Photoshop picture of Mariah Lynn put on her Instagram story on my Patreon because it's not even going to make the cut onto the YouTube channel right now. Okay. Um, so that happened. And then, I mean, they still going M mango. No, sit. You came in here. Lying saying your eye wasn't closed is crazy. Everybody on production saw your eye big like a baseball. I hate liars, bro. Even though we squashed it, stop lying like I, I didn't beat your A. You wore glasses for two weeks, bro. I even told you uh, to your face I feel bad for effing your eye up. But <laughs> since you want to be funny, I'm going to show you hilarious. Girl, when I say you better not do it. When I say Mariah Lynn was begging Let's fight again. I want to go again. Like she kept wanting to fight. I just don't 
understand. Okay. Um, so just go watch it on the Patreon. It's crazy, quite frankly. I ain't never seen nothing like it. Uh, you picked a fight and lost itch. Why is you not clocking out? <laughs> <laughs> itch was fighting the air if security wasn't there and wasn't steady breaking it up i would have dragged mariah all across that field it would have never been four rounds itch would have got atl stomped <laughs> i'm sorry um mariah i'm still prettier than you uh asian doll said you sure girl that's that on that y'all let me know what y'all think about this down in the comment section below I reacted to a couple videos last night that I'm adding on to these videos. Yes, I'm adding on. I need y'all to see all the content. I'm about to put out all kinds of content this season, okay? We in the second quarter of the year. It's going down. We actually was in the second quarter of the year in June, but let's not talk about it. I'm late to the party, okay? But, yeah, let's get into it. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. And, yeah, enjoy all right, y'all. So this next segment of the video, I had something else planned, but it got yellow. So we, we're we just not even going to talk about it. But what we're about to talk about is Usher's speech yesterday. BET messed up Usher's speech yesterday. And quite frankly, I was about to go live. I still think I am. But like, I just don't understand how you mess up an entire uh, legendary moment like that. Like... He said one curse word and they was like, oh, hell no. Nah. We just going to mute the whole speech. If I was Usher, I wouldn't know how to feel, quite honestly. I would not know how to feel. And, I mean, that's it helps that he's a grown man, okay, and he's been doing legendary things for a very long time. So I'm sure he's handling it like a G. But how would y'all handle it is what I want to know. Would BET have to owe y'all something? You know what I'm saying? I mean, you're going to have to run me a coin or something. Uh, if not a coin, you're going to have to run me something. Hell, I, I'm going to have to do my speech over, run the show over. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and, and maybe that's just petty, but, like, I don't like it. And I just thought that y'all should know. Um, I'm probably about to go live. That's really how I feel about the speech. I can't react to the speech, so that's that on that. Oh, my favorite part about the BET Awards was Tiana Taylor and Victoria Monet. I'm about to go live. <laughs> I love y'all. Bye. In the meantime, in between time, y'all make sure y'all tap into the Patreon and watch that Asian doll and Mariah Lynn fight. And even if you already watched it, watch my reaction. It's hilarious. Okay. Um, sis really got whooped and over and over and over again. Just go watch it. Bye.